All right, so we are off to see Dr. Werber, uh, our vet. Make sure that uh, Teddy's okay. A little checkup. I have some, uh, one of those things is, as they get older, um, I wonder how long is too long. And uh, for me, it's when does it turn to be selfish and you're trying to keep your puppy around too long relative to what's best for the puppy. So, today's one of those days where I'm going in to hopefully hear that she's doing good. She's slow, but she's old, so that's all right, you know? Um, I'm slow, so I'm hoping to get some good news. You know, the, the key is really, when you have a dog like this, first of all, understand, uh, much of it is genetics, okay? We it's are just, good genetics in the family. Yeah, it's, yes, you get like, that's good. <laughs> much of it is just, is really just luck of the draw, you know. Um, I, I knew some of Grover Sims that didn't, didn't live this long. I mean, the, the basics are, you know, really no different than a person, eating well. We are what we eat. Eating right. well, exercising. Keeping the muscles toned, um, cardiovascularly, uh, which is great. You know, the exercise comes right. in that, that helps the cardiovascular system, um, and uh, being very aware of changes in their mentation, their behavior, their appetite, and jumping on those changes. In other words, if you see a change, have it checked out. So, Teddy, <laughs> Teddy girl, hi, sweetie. So a couple of things we're going to see just also with age, and one of the things that really freaks people out, if you look at her eyes, and the pupils, instead of being black, they kind of have like a grayish tint, right. okay? And that is something called nuclear or lenticular sclerosis, and it's an old age change. Okay. It's a very normal age change. Her heart sounds regular. Her lungs are really nice and clear. I mean, she's panting because she's nervous, yeah. but I'm hearing very open airways. I'm not hearing any sounds, which is great. So one of the things we're doing is uh, she's still making it up the stairs four or five times a day. She's Amazing. Just, and, and this we we go off to the gym, we come back, she's upstairs. Right. It's like, what, what you go up there for? <laughs> Looking for you. Right, right, you right, know, right. kind of thing. Um, and one of the things is, is, is a concern, but my belief is, again, it's, it's the whole concept is your body adapts to the pressures put under it. And it's the same thing for animals. I'm assuming that the bone structure, again, if we can keep her moving, we can keep her Absolutely. exercising, keeping forcing that, we can keep her longer. Yeah, you know, I saying when, when we we see a lot of obesity. Right. What I talk about to clients is the same thing. I'm sure you deal with when you know people that you're going to train is mm -hmm. that the bigger you get, the tougher it is to move. Right. The less you move, the bigger you're going to get. Yes. You got to make those those changes. You got to right. increase that exercise. You got to. Decrease that caloric intake. You gotta eat the right foods. Gotta keep and, moving, baby. You gotta keep moving. There you go. Get your traction. Get your traction. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> fast. Yeah. Um, all right, great. So, uh, meanwhile, what I would tell whatever you're doing, keep, keep doing, doing it. it. Keep doing it. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a great lesson for everybody. <laughs> that, you know, take good care of your dog just like you take good care of yourself. This is what you get. The one thing is, um, and, and you understand this, is, is the, uh, you want to carry them. You want to start babying them, right. mostly at this age. And the hardest thing for me is to watch her walk up the stairs. Right. And know that's what's the best for her, even right. though it's tearing it's me up. Kid, right. and, and, and society sees that and they go, dude, what's wrong with you? Why, why are you doing that? Yeah. Uh, and, and them saying no, pick her up, carry her, and you got to sit there and go, no, this is no. this is what's best. You need, you, if they, the, the best thing for them is to have that exercise, to have that muscle tone. Um, and uh, you know, even when you when you talk to like, for example, a friend of mine's a cardiologist, and you know, when I you know leaned it down a lot, right, about 25 years ago, um, he asked how much resistance training was I doing. I wasn't doing a lot. I was doing a lot of running, a lot of right, right. a lot of swimming, right. He says, no, 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 you gotta still do resistance training. You gotta, you gotta keep that muscle tone. 
you know, can bulk up. But even more time. bone density. Yeah, yeah. Connective absolutely. tissue. Right. So it's the same thing goes. So if, if they, if, if, if she wants to do it, Except they're cute. let her do it. What? The, they're cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not right. more handsome than you, yeah, though. No, 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 see? That's what it is. That's what it is. <laughs> love you, man. All right. Thank you. Take Thanks care. For doing this. Oh, you're welcome. I'll see you on you're the next welcome. trip, though. Yep. Oh, yeah. You're coming with us. Yes. Absolutely. All right. See ya. All right, so uh, Teddy kind of performed today. <laughs> I haven't seen her move that well in a while. So the way she moves, the way the uh, doctor was talking and everything that we saw on her today, she looks great. Keep doing what we're doing. Uh, we did do some blood work, so we'll wait to hear from that. But as of right now, she's kicking ass and taking names. So it was a great day. We are taking her now to uh, eat into the beach today and enjoy the day with her.